Hi, Mayfield. It is Thursday, September 30th, 2021, and this is the homework video for my Math 6 students, my periods 2, 3, and 5. Good afternoon. How are you? Reminder, we have our first quiz tomorrow. It is going to be done on Canvas, so you will get an automatic second attempt. And this is your homework I gave you Monday that is due tomorrow. It is front and back. I did go to the suggestion box and I did have a few suggestions. So thank you for asking for help when you need it. Um, the question I pulled randomly was for this question right here. And it says for each triangle below, draw a height segment that corresponds to the given base and label it H. Um, you can use any kind of straight edge. It doesn't have to be an index card. Um, I have an index card, but you can use a different straight edge instead if you'd like. We talked about that for a base and a height to be appropriate for a triangle, we do need to have them meet so they form a 90 degree angle. And maybe you have to extend the base or the height for them to meet, but you're looking for that 90 degree angle when they touch. And sometimes it helps if you rotate your paper. So here is my base. And we did practice with this in class earlier Sometimes I like to make a dashed line at the very top of the highest part of the triangle looking up from the base. And then I'm gonna draw that straight 90 degree angle from the top of the triangle down to my base. And I'm going to label it height. So that's one appropriate height. But it doesn't have to be that height. Maybe you wanna do it from the outside of the base. That's fine. And then you want to go straight up and down. And that can be your height and your 90 degree angle. Or maybe you want to do it on this side of the base. And you want to have your base and your height and your straight up and down line and your 90 degree angle. There are multiple heights that you could draw as long as they're forming that 90 degree angle when they hit your base. And then for the second triangle, what do you think? You can pause me if you need for a minute. We're gonna rotate again. Sometimes it's just easier for me to have my base at the bottom. And it's not gonna be this side or this side of the triangle because they are slanted. But again, I'm gonna use my index card and kind of just draw like a dashed line here with the top of the triangle. And then I'm gonna draw my height that connects that dash line to my base. So for example, here would be a height. Straight up and down from the base. Or maybe right here, straight up and down meeting the base. Or maybe we even extend the base a little bit. We had some practice with that as well. And then that extension all the way up to meet the height. So here are several appropriate heights for B and several appropriate heights for A. I hope that helps. Uh, good luck tomorrow on your quiz. Remember, we'll be starting with a brain dump. We practiced one of those today. I look forward to seeing you. Have a great afternoon. Bye, everybody.